What's going on YouTube? Today we're doing another shoe review. Today these are going to be some Doc Martens. Um, little bad story. I just ordered these like a few days ago. Um, like three days ago. Because I had a subscriber ask me to do like another pair of Doc Martens. And I already done those. So go to my page and you see those. It's like the last video uploaded. And I kind of went Doc Martin crazy a little piece. Because like the original Doc Martens ST I'm not a big fan of. But when I seen these, like, they just grabbed my attention off the rip. So tomorrow on the 8th, they're dropping a collab of Rick Owens, you know, Doc Martens. I don't even know the price of them, but they really grasped my attention. I love, like, the design and the distinctness. Uh, I'm probably going to say that right. Whatever. But I kind of just want to jump, dive right into it. All right, so it's going to be pretty simple. Not like my last video. Oh, not the one I got the... Uh, the Air Jordans. So I'm just gonna open the box up. Okay. Uh, white box. Pretty legit, pretty legit. Um it says the name right here. So I'm just let's go ahead and take them right out. I'm trying to look at the name on it. It says Sukoki oh, oh, oh. I don't even I don't even know what that says. That's the name. I can't even pronounce that. Maybe somebody can pronounce it. Whatever. Do a little quick around the box. That's what they look like. Uh, these range me. These are kind of, not gonna lie. These are pretty pricey. These range me from like 240, I believe. So like adding on tax. You know how the dog market's got a little print in the back. You know. I keep on feeling a hole at the bottom. That's weird. And these came from like a legit like website, um, like a designer website where they have like a whole bunch of exclusives. Um, Sukoke.com. So I guess that's how you say it. Sukoke. I don't, I don't, that's not even where I got the shoes from, but I guess that's in collaboration with Doc Martens. Yeah, that's weird though how the box came with a hole in them. I feel like someone personally did that themselves because the box have a hole in them so should i report that like should i be like oh improper packaging uh, i might so we have the box open here's like a first look you know um dot martin's print uh wrap paper we're just gonna open that up a bit pretty weird these are on the side that's not a good indicator those are you supposed to be in the shoes uh throw that to the side um Okay, okay. Pretty legit. Um They're decent. Like just first like look. They're a pair of Doc Martins. And like I'm not a huge fan of Doc Martins. But like some of the designs, like I'd be like, oh okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. These are unique. Um oh, my phone's starting to die a little bit. To be honest, I don't believe that they should be going for two. 40 and up. That's not even including tax. Uh, you know, I got a little tag right here. Pretty basic, just saying a name. Um, nice. I love the design. I love like sandals. They look pretty comfortable. You can tell these are comfortable. Just look how thick that is. Just alone. You know, that's just a sole. How thick is the sole? And then you got the whole heel that's going to sit up uh, roughly probably uh, like an inch. Or so so these are definitely providing a lot of comfort for the foot all the way up to the ankles and some so yeah just giving a quick look around I should I I'm not sure if I should pull out both of them because pretty sure they look the same okay so so if I pull out the second one right here they're, they're, they're exactly the same my thing is because uh, I thought one I'm just gonna rip it open I thought I thought one of these we're missing. Oh, yeah, it's like the um, something hard right there. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I guess this was just extra extra paper. I don't want to just throw it to the side. Let's see if there's something in here. Maybe maybe they're in a rush because they did get here pretty quickly. No cap. Um, so that's what they look like. 
like I said, these range for 240, so you're gonna be spending like 270 with tax and everything included. Just about. I love the scraps, the Velcro scraps. I'm always a fan of the buckles on the shoes. I love the designs. It's kind of my thing. They low key look like dad shoes. Just how like how high they're gonna make you sit up. These are pretty cool. They're like they're just unique. Um, if they weren't Doc Martens, um, it just were like some off brands. I'll be looking like, what the fuck are these, honestly. Um, but yeah, you know, they stand out, though. They're pretty cool. Um, all the details. I love the the orange, yellow, no, that's yellow trimming, um, stitching around. That's pretty cool, you know. Kind of stands out so you know where they are. Like, only way you know it's Doc Martens because it's all black on black. Because it says Doc Martens on the, um, it says Doc Martens on the side right here. And then it says Sukkok uh, around the inviting atmosphere, wear comfortable products, Sukkok. I don't even know, I don't know who or where, or what is Sukkok's, but I guess that's a collab. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. It's just a collab, you know? Uh, these are gonna make me, I'm only 5'5". Five five. These are gonna make me look like I'm like 5'8", no cap. So if you want a little taller, these are definitely a good shoe for you. So we're just gonna jump right into the um, the on foot review because you know it's pretty self explanatory. That's why I like doing sandals and stuff like that because it's not really much to talk about unless you want to know about specs. But I am gonna drop a link to where you can get these. Uh, hopefully I can find a, a cheaper link. But if not, you can just get them exactly where I got mine from, and I'll put that right in the description. Please like, share, and subscribe my videos because I put a lot of work and effort finding different shoes, um, doing the reviews, traveling, balancing life, you know, work and everything. So, yeah, all the love, all the comments, all the likes, the subscribes. I really do appreciate it because it just shows me I'm doing something well. So, let's just jump right into it. So, here I am trying to, like, get all of this out, you know, that's a little paper at the top. I just did completed the other shoe. And it was kind of like a lot of work, but this one should be much smoother. So I basically, you know, I just ease all the tension. Um, I just start unbuckling everything. Like, especially the ones right here, they're not really doing me much justice. Um, they're just, I guess, be tight on your feet once you actually place them on your feet. But so to actually take this whole piece out because, you no, know, the it's the cardboard um, that usually goes in like the toes of like most shoes. This is like wrapped all the way to the back. So it's pretty solid. Um, so we're just gonna scrap that. Um, gonna loosen this tension uh, just a, quite a bit, you know? And then what I did with the last one, I just started from right there. And just start with a little wiggle and just snatch it out. Um, there you go. So pretty dope. So that's what it looked like, you know, just without anything in them so far. Uh, you look at the soles. Super comfortable, super therapeutic, um, 100%. Like, I'm squishing them, like, they're really comfortable. Like, you can tell, like, on my feet, I can walk miles and miles in these without problems. I love sandals. And these are, these are huge sandals. These are not no average size sandals. Like, these are an eight and a half. I was kind of, like, tricky because um, when I placed the order for these shoes, they were in, like, European sizes. So I had to, like, you know, go on Google and, like, uh, what is that? But I finally found my correct size. I hope so. Um, yeah, I just wanted to show like a brief uh, video, like yeah. So here we are with the on foot review. These are ten out of ten, the most comfortable shoes I have ever worn in my life. Uh, ooh, why am I why I'm recording this right now? I just noticed. I, I did I look at the bottom of these? I was doing all that other stuff. I guess not. Um, yeah. It's just all plain black at the bottom, you know, nothing special. These are like my first pair of boot sandals. I when I stood up, I was def I definitely felt like I put on a good two or three inches inches on my height. These are pretty legit. Um very unique. I have never seen a pair of shoes like this on um, sandals. Um, you know, you see the design, but like, for them to be Doc Martens, you know, Doc Martens usually makes boots that are super comfortable. But these for these be like sandals. Um, I guess it's a collab with Suko. Uh, hopefully I'm saying that right. 
Yeah, they did a, a decent job. 10 out of 10. Uh, price, I wish it was a little bit cheaper, but you know, you pay for what you get. These are shoes that I can definitely see myself wearing a lot. Uh, not so easy to, you know, to get into because there's so many scraps. Like, it's one right here. Another one at the bottom of that. Uh, get a good view of it. Uh, and three more on the front. So, another scrap. And the little buckles right here. So, not the easiest shoes to get into. You're not just going to slide in these. But once you get into them, you are definitely stuck. And you're very comfortable. You're not even going to be one. That's, you know, you ain't no rest to take them off, honestly. Yeah, so that's what they look like. Um, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. You know, like, but these would be my first pair. Like I said, like, regardless of the price, I find it was a good buy. Um, glad I was able to do a review on some Doc Martens. I'm glad that my, one of my subscribers told me to do a do a pair of Doc Martens. He wasn't really too specific. He was like, buy whatever you like. Um, I got these. It caught my attention. Um, definitely an eye opener. When you walk out in these, and people are going to stare low-key. That's in my um, personal opinion because I know I would. Um, but, yeah, please like, share, and subscribe. I will drop a link in the description. Please comment. Uh, what would you like to see next? Hop on COD. My name is Don Dada Chase. If you guys ever want to play, hop on one of my videos. Um, yeah, until next time. Thank you for watching.